hi everyone welcome to my channel this is Mickey Sunshine Creates and I'm Mickey hi hi <laughs> I have an unboxing here today one I'm very excited about because I don't often get Diamond Art Club but thanks to a couple of gift certificates I got me a couple of them I'm gonna open one now they both came in the same box this is a big one as you can see by the blue square, it's a square. That makes it easy, doesn't it? Yeah, makes it very easy. Beautiful packaging. On the back it says, gives you uh, steps to diamond painting. Very, very easy. And this one is, oh my God, it's 98 by 70 centimeters. Oh my gosh, it's huge. Yes! Look, look, look at this! Look at this! Ooh. And I just dropped my light pad. Oh well! <laughs> it's huge. But we're going to open it up. I might not be able to show you the whole thing. But I fell in love with this as soon as I saw it. As soon as I saw it. And I didn't get it right away. I thought I had. But I didn't. Else in here? Whoop! Whoop! Yep. Ooh, in there. I know I've dropped things. I got the dropsies. Okay, let's start with the sticker. It's so nice to have a sticker. Not sure what I'm gonna do with it, but it's a nice sticker. Anyway, toolkit. Diamond Art Club toolkits are one they're branded which is really nice they're a really nice sturdy plastic and i like that they're translucent rather than transparent and uh it comes the square kit and it's and it okay i can open it all right uh, so i ripped it um <laughs> it says square toolkit and it's cool too because you get uh, a heart shape wax I love those heart shape waxes not that I use them I use uh, here we go I use uh, super sticky and you get a few baggies I'm not sure what good these are really because there's only four of them and there's not much you can do with four of them but you save them up you get more than four it comes with a blue pen and a squishy to make it comfortable. I'm not going to put that on now. It comes with a really, really sharp, sharp, sharp tweezers. Be very careful. Keep the cover on because th these things will cut you. I've been lucky enough not to have been stabbed so far, but I wouldn't put it past me. And it comes with a clear drill tray or boat or whatever you want to call it. And this is where you put the drills to shake them out and get them straightened out. Okay. It also comes with this lovely, lovely inventory. And I'm going to show you the picture. It's by David McLean. And it's called... Let's see if I turn on this light. Will that help? Or make it worse? I don't know. Country Inn and Farm. It's just, there we go. It's absolutely gorgeous. I'll see if I can put up a picture here to show you. I'm not very good at editing yet. <laughs> I'm getting there. Now, for the pièce de résistance. I know, I'm silly. Uh, are these sealed at both ends? Look at that. They're sealing them at both ends. How nice. Or is it? Nope, they're not. Okay. I don't have to cut it open. Ooh, that makes a lot of noise. Oop. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of drills. That's a lot of drills. Ah, 
that's a lot of canvas. Okay, plastic gets thrown away because we don't keep plastic. Let's get this out of the way. Get these out of the way. All right. Um, shall we took it to pick? Oh, you get a step-by-step -step instruction booklet, which is really nice because it gives you step-by-steps, nine steps to getting it perfect. And it does. Plus, you can get a 10% off on your next purchase, which is nice. And I think the invoice gives you a 15% off code. But let's take a look at this gorgeous painting. Oh, upside down. All right, this is going to have to be opened in... <laughs> Whoa. This is called Governor's Party. No, it's not. I told you already. This was called Country Inn and Farm. And it, it, it's just beautiful. Look at that house. I love that house, that country house. And what else is there? I can't see. There's a truck, like a Jeep, and a little mailbox. I love it. And there we go. Let's open it some more. And we'll see beautiful trees and cows and a puppy dog. Then in the background, there's barn. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, I love this. I love this. Look at the puppy dog. Look how big I I don't know how I'm going to work on this. I, re I really don't. <laughs> this is so big. I'm gonna have to work on it sideways, I think, and keep it rolled. Because um, no way am I gonna be able to work on it this way. Not on this desk. Even this is gonna, this way is gonna be difficult. But let's look at the drills. Open this. Oh, look, I love, oh, it's so soft. Diamond Art Club has very nice Wait a second. Diamond Art Club has very nice canvases. They're tarpaulin-like, um, soft, and if you need to get it really straightened out, you can roll it the opposite way, but you don't have to. It'll just, it'll ease off by itself. But let's take a look at the drill field. Sticky. Sticky. Yep, sticky. And the drill field is really clear. Really clear. You have a a very nice key or whatever you want to call this and it, it's it's big so it's easily to easy to read. So a very nice key right here on the upper right left and I think you have another one. I can't do this. <laughs> it's just too big. I mean, I'm having a lot of fun. Um, you have one on the lower right so you can see what you're doing if that's the way you work. I work with symbols. I will put symbols on my boxes and I will match symbols. I don't go with uh, DMC numbers. That would, And then having to go back and forth to the sim to the key, uh-uh, that would drive me crazy. So I prefer using symbols. And these symbols are, but you don't need a light pad for this. You really don't. So, it's really good. I, I'm, I'm always impressed with Diamond Art Club. Always. All right, let's take a look. The drills. Oh boy, these are very full colors. These are very full color. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of them. Do you want me to go through them or just count them? I'm supposed to have 54 colors. And there are two ABs, one and two. Ooh, nice. 
We'll take a look at where those go later. But Country Inn and Farm, it's marked right on there. So if you want to keep them separate, um, you can. You know, a lot of people keep their canvases separate from their drills to make it easier to store canvases. This one I will keep stored rolled because it's it's just too big to lay flat anywhere in my house. In fact, I'm trying to figure out where I'm gonna hang it up. I still have Sneaky's cat. I haven't figured out where to hang out. That's another big one. Okay, let's take a look at colors. We'll take a look at the colorful colors first. <laughs> Crackle alert if you have uh, headphones. Be warned. I'm going to be scrunching up some plastic right here. And I know how it feels in your headphones. Very annoying. So, there we go. Oh. Oh, the colors are pretty. <laughs> oh, my color the colors are gorgeous. Okay, let's see what we have here. We have, oh, let's bring this down a little. Woo! Come on. Mickey, you could do better than that. There we go. Because I can't reach that far. <laughs> it was really high up. Turn off the light. I don't think we need it. There we go. We have 37.72, which is a nice, Chocolatey brown, 977, nice okra, 606, two of them, which is definitely a bright red, 402, looks like another okra, uh, 3826, I don't know if you can see these, maybe I should keep the light back on, all right, I'll leave the light back on, yeah, that's better. 3826. Two of them. 3864. I like this color. I love neutrals. As well as bright colors. So 3778. Yum. Looks like cassava melon. 301. Another brownish color. Brownish orange. Two 301s, there's two of those. 779, and there's two of those. Don't look at my nails, they're awful. 666. Six, six. <gasps> Three of them. Oh my. Now this is the brightest red. I, I love 666. It's <laughs> bright. Bright, bright. Okay, 300, and there's four of these too. Now this is a true chocolate brown look at that I don't know if you can see that it's hard you get the reflection you got the color I'm sorry I wish I had a better setup all right let's look at the pretty stuff the pretty colors the bright colors we have 414 which is gray 317 which is a darker gray 905 which is really nice green it's it's lighter than it shows in the camera i don't know why it's showing so dark that 961 which is not a red it's a coral and yeah the camera doesn't do it justice 3853 which is a, a pale orange not not pale but it's a muted orange not this <laughs> this looks like a bright orange in the camera. It's not. Here's a hunter green. Very nice. Here's pink. Again, a muted pink. 3733. I like this. And again, the camera is not showing the true colors. I'm sorry. Uh, 3861, a beige or tan or... Mm, I don't know. It's... A mob? No, not a mob. Definitely a tan or something. Uh, $37.99 is a dark, dark gray. That's a dark gray. $38.56 is apricot. 
it's uh, it's not as bright as it's showing on the camera it's very pale well not pale again muted but it's apricot oh it's delicious here's a 904 looks like a tree green i think i'd call it again lighter or or paler than it shows on the tv on the camera uh 3860 there's two of them brown another brown but more of a beigey brown if there's such a thing okay 3731 another muted color that shows up bright i'm sorry 498 now this is close to that color not as uh yeah it's it's sparkly all right but 498 is nice oh there's two of those Two four ninety eight, so that'll be a lot of four ninety eight. One thirty three. Now this is a bright. <gasps> eh, eh. A B. This is an A B. Oh, can you see the sparkle? Can you see the sparkle? This is an A B. <gasps> it's beautiful. An orange A B. I like it. I like it very much. I wonder where the other one is. Okay, 741, which is another. That's an orange. A, 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 a navel orange. <laughs> I wish. Again, it's a little paler than it looks. Uh, this looks like an orange orange, like a, you know, a regular orange. 740, and there's two of them. So, I guess we have a lot of orange and red in here. And maroon. Oh, I like that. I like that. Let's go on to the new, to the darker colors. Eh, they're not necessarily dark, that darker. Crackle alert again, if you're wearing a headset. I don't mean to bother you too much. Now getting these back in. I don't know, I can do that. Okay, what have we got, what have we got, what have we got? We have... We have 327, which is purple. And it, it does not look like purple. I wonder if I turn off the light, will it look like purple? It looks a little bit more like purple. I'm going back and forth with this light because I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, the light looks a little bit more purple. And this blue, 3760, does look, it looks better without the light. You're right, I should have turned off the light. 973 this is a, a lemon yellow not that looks like an orange yellow this is a lemon yellow 3818 318 that's gray nice 718 pretty little magenta 823 dark dark black oh it's a black it's a gray black 742 another orange again muter than it looks in the in the picture. I don't know why oranges and reds show up differently. That's my camera. I need a new camera. Okay, nah, 312, which is a mm, nice blue. Royal blue. 135, which is 135. Anything below 150 is an AB. So this is a yellow AB. Can you see the sparkle? Oh, I love it. I love this sparkle. AB stands for Aurora Borealis, which is uh, a coating that's put on the top of the drill, and it's it's iridescent, so it looks a lot like the Aurora Borealis, and that's why it's called that. ABs. All right, thirty sixty four. It's another reddish beige. I don't. I can't attribute it to any food or anything. 907 except for this this is a celery green <laughs> that's the only thing i guess again it's paler than showing on the camera 470 a little darker green 604 of this is i wish you could see the pink this is it, th it this is a pretty pink uh, i would say this is a perfect pink 
and uh, again the way it shows on the camera mm. a lousy camera or lousy f maybe i need more light i don't know 803 803 pretty blue navy blue 3855 a lighter apricot again it's too dark on the camera 3325 now this blue is almost right a little paler but almost right really pretty uh, 890, another green hunter. I can't, it doesn't even show. It just looks like black. No, it looks like black. 413, a gray. 3854, another orange or an apricot, darker. 415, a light gray. And let's see what else we have here. We have 3371. We have two, three, four, four of those. And this is a dark chocolate brown. Oh, it's good enough to eat. This is a dark chocolate brown. Probably for the house. 948. A very pale coral, very pale, a little paler than, than what's showing. Another chocolate brown, 938, there's four of those, no, make that five. Five of those, 938, woo, that's a lot of color. And this, this is also a chocolate brown, but a little, it's lighter than the dark chocolate. And we have 310, only three of them. Yay! I'm going to be living a brown life today. <laughs> I work on this. So we have 310, we have three of those. We have 400, we have three of those, which is uh, light chocolate brown, a little orange in it, I guess. It's, it's definitely a brown. It does have a little bit of red, like a redwood brown. Yeah. And again, it's lighter than what's showing in the, uh, in the camera. And last but not least, 321. A pretty red. Another red. So we have with us here <laughs> a lot of, a lot of colors. Oh my God. There's a lot of color here. There is a lot of color here. Oh, let's see if we can get these back in the in the container. Okay, that's we're gonna try. See, I, I folded it. I'm not sure if I folded it well, but another crackle alert. We're gonna try and put these in the way we got them. Oh, hold on to it. Flip it inside. <gasps> Look at that! I did it! I did it! Ha! I'm not that bad. It's it's not that hard. I know people sometimes complain that it's difficult to get these back in the into the the bags, but let's go with the next the last the other one. It's Usually it's four. It's four wide. So if you keep it four wide and not drop it. <laughs> yeah, if you keep it four wide and don't drop it.
then it, it's not that difficult to put them back. Not at all. I'll just start with this end. It's a little messy. It's a little harder. It's <laughs> oh. I like doing it that way. Okay, we got that. And we got that. Come on. Open this one up. Squeeze these together. Put these in here. We'll put them in here. There we go. All right, not perfect. But you know what? It doesn't have to be. But it's better than leaving them all out. There we go. There we go. All right, not perfect. This one's better. But these were thicker. Oh, we did it. See, I did it. Yay. Now let's see where the ABs are. Ooh. I'll pull you up a little bit so you can see more of my messy desk. Let's see, we have one and two. One is the orange and two is the yellow, I do believe. Let me see. Yeah, one and two. We have, where do we have one? One, one, one. Oh. I don't see one anywhere. Of course, I'm not very good at looking for these. Nope, not at all. That looks like I'm lousy at looking for these. I don't know how you girls do it. You seem to find them right away. And I can't. Ah, here's some one. I know there's more. Here's some one over here. There's got to be more because there's a lot of ones. A lot of that orange. And I have no idea where that yellow goes. Maybe in the house? No. For the lights? No. Somebody's home. Where does the two go? There's not a lot of... Oh, there's the two. Two is a... It's green on the... There's the two. That's pretty. And two over here to highlight the bushes. And the one highlights the grass or the grounds or whatever. Nice. There's a truck there. There's a Jeep here and a truck here. So the ones go over here. Highlight this and this over here. Green is up here or yellow. Really, it's a yellow. A B. But this is uh, this is beautiful. Uh, it's huge. It's gonna take me a while. I don't know whether to do this now or to save it for a new another biggin uh, challenge. It's hard to decide now and I just knocked the box over <laughs> but this is country in farm by David McLean and in my opinion 
probably as good as Chuck Pinson. I mean, a lot of detail. There's a lot of confetti. Not respectful confetti either. Though, I like that. And again, the, um, the key have larger numbers on him now. Larger symbols. So you can see them much easier on your... Because uh, you could cut these up. This is a sticker. And you could cut these up and place them on your containers. I use Harbor Freight. But anyway, I want to thank you all for joining me today. Um, I hope you had as much fun opening this as I did. Boy. It's, it's going to be a fun. Um, thank you for coming. And if you're new. Hi, hi. If you. And if you are new, I hope you would subscribe. And, you know, join my family. My sunshine family. There we go. I'm going to call myself the sunshine family. Um, hit a thumbs up on your way out. That will help me. And basically, have a wonderful, wonderful day, week, month, year. Let's hope everything gets better. And in the meantime, I leave it up to you.